13 signs a woman hasn't had sex for a long time. Did you know that subtle changes in a woman's behavior could potentially clue you in on her sexual activity? Fascinating, isn't it? Psychologists agree that our actions can indeed mirror our emotional state and experiences. And yes, that includes sexual activity or the lack thereof. Trust me, this insight can be a game changer in understanding and navigating relationships. We're diving deep into a curious world, exploring a range of indicators that might suggest a woman hasn't been sexually active for a while. Now, this isn't an exact science and everyone's different, so keep an open mind as we delve into this fascinating subject. From her social media habits to the way she expresses emotions, we will unravel how these behaviours could reflect her sexual life. Social media, a window into her world ever found yourself deep diving into someone's social media and noticing a sudden shift in their posts? Consider this. Psychologists suggest that a woman who's not been in the sexual game for a while might up her social media game instead. You might notice an uptick in selfies, chatty comments, or even bolder statements. It's her subtle way of reacting out and stirring up a little bit of interaction. Could it be a sign she's been on a dating hiatus? Just bear in mind we are all unique and social media offers just a glimpse, not the entire picture. The confidence conundrum, a silent signal. Picture this scenario, a friend or an acquaintance, usually a beacon of self-confidence and poise, suddenly seems too dim, their sparkle seems a tad less bright, their energy levels a shade less vibrant. A noticeable shift, almost as if they are morphing into a somewhat subdued version of their usual self. You can't help but wonder, what's going on? Well, here's when things get fascinating. Experts agree that periods of sexual inactivity can sometimes act as tremors, subtly shaking the foundations of one's confidence. It's an intriguing concept, isn't it? The even flow of our intimate lives subtly influencing our self-image and the way we interact with the world around us. Laughter, a love language or a cry for connection. Ever been in a crowd and heard a single laugh cut through the noise? Psychologists have a curious observation about this. That pearl of laughter could be more than just amusement. It might signal a need for attention or validation stemming from a dry spell in her love life. Intriguing really, isn't it? Laughter, particularly the loud, out of the blue kind, might be a subconscious siren for social connection. But remember, laughter is as individual as a fingerprint, so it's not really a surefire sign. The people pleaser, an indication of intimacy inactivity. Ever cross paths with a people pleaser? Someone that seems to go the extra mile for others' happiness. Here's a curious fact. Studies suggest this over-the-top kindness could indicate that a woman has been off the sexual radar for a bit. This behavior is often a sign of seeking validation or a deeper connection. But don't jump to conclusions just yet. Altruism can be a personality trait too, not merely a beacon for intimacy needs. Touchy topics, a public affection, a plea for connection. Have you ever wondered why a certain woman tends to be more tactile in public? The answer may surprise you. Psychologists suggest that an uptick in touchy behavior could hint at dormant sexual activity. It's her non-verbal way of satisfying a craving for intimacy and connection. A gentle touch on the arm, a prolonged handshake, even a playful nudge. They all could be signposts, but remember the rule book of respect and consent should always be your guide. The green-eyed glanced envy or an unvoiced craving. Ever noticed her eyeing other women's relationships with a tinge of envy? This could be more than just standard jealousy at play. Experts suggest that this green-eyed monster might signify her longing for the physical and emotional bond she observes others sharing, particularly if she's been on a love hiatus. But let's not forget, envy is a multi-layered emotion and can stem from a lot of factors. The spark, heightened arousal or a silent signal. Ever found yourself wondering if a woman seemingly heightened arousal might be communicating something? Here is a fun fact. Studies suggest that an extended period of sexual inactivity can dial up a woman's responses to sensual stimuli. That rosy blush or quickened breath might just be her quiet way of revealing her time away from the dating game. Always remember though, arousal is a personal thing and understanding boundaries is key. Super sensitivity, an emotional echo or just 
just type tuned. Ever crossed paths with a woman who appears to experience emotions more vividly than others? If she's been steering clear of the sexual scene for a while, she might display this amplified sensitivity. Be it a tear-jerking movie scene or a spirited debate, her reactions could seem more intense. Psychologists propose that it might be her subconscious making up for the absence of intimate emotional connections. But keep in mind, sensitivity is as diverse as we are. Fear of loss, a red herring, or a silent alarm. Ever observed a woman who seems to be constantly anxious about losing her close ones? Here is something to ponder. This fear of loss could sometimes be a sign of sexual inactivity. Psychologists suggest that the lack of close, intimate relationships might turn up the volume on fears of losing existing emotional bonds. It's as though her mind is trying to secure what she has even tighter. But remember, fear of loss can also stem from personal experiences or even anxiety. Mothering instincts, a subtle hint. Ever seen a woman in your circle showing a stronger, nurturing motherly instinct recently? Psychologists suggest that this shift could indicate that she's been sexually inactive for a spell. It's her unique way of satisfying the yearning for profound emotional connections, typically found in intimate relationships. But let's not forget, nurturing can also just be a part of her caring personality. The clingy conundrum, a cry for intimacy. Ever found yourself intrigued by a friend who seems to be your new shadow? There might be more than friendly vibes in the air. Experts suggest that a sudden clinginess might be her silent way of hinting that she's been out of the intimate loop. This will be constant texts, constant calls, or an overwhelming desire to spend time together. This could be her way of reaching out for physical and emotional closeness that she's missing. It's key to remember to approach the situation with sensitivity and respect for her feelings. Friend zoning, a defense mechanism or a dating detour? Ever scratched your head wondering why a woman seems to put everyone firmly in the friend zone? Well, here is an interesting nugget. Psychologists indicate this might signal she's taken a breather from the dating scene. By maintaining a safe distance from potential partners, she might be subconsciously shielding herself from the vulnerability that comes with intimacy. Now remember, everyone needs their own space and time to re-enter the dating game. So a generous dose of patience and understanding really does go a long way. Yearning for dominance, a sign of inactivity. Have you observed a woman in your circle who seems to be comfortable, even preferential about being dominated in non-sexual contexts? Here's something to consider. Studies suggest this could be a clue of a recent hiatus from sexual activity. She might be redirecting her suppressed desires for dominance in the bedroom to other aspects of her life. But don't forget, dominance preferences can just be a part of her unique personality or lifestyle, not necessarily necessarily a billboard for sexual inactivity. So you've made it this far, what's next you ask? How about exploring where women like you to touch sexually? Or do you want to decode her silent sexual signals? Choose your next step wisely and don't forget to hit like, comment your thoughts and subscribe for more insights. Thank you so much for tuning in.